I get him? Yep, I got him. That is a little bullfrog with a tail. Right there. He's got a tail. Hang on. Did I get him? Yep, I got him. Check this out. This is crazy. That is a little bullfrog with a tail. What? Nope. <laughs> Almost lost him right there. Look at this. That is a little baby bullfrog. Now you may be wondering, why does this baby bullfrog have a tail? Well, as we know, as babies, frogs start off as tadpoles, and they live in the water, and as we know, tadpoles have a tail, kind of a paddle tail for swimming along. And as they become a frog, they grow their back legs first, their front legs, and then they begin to slowly lose their tail and get a bigger mouth. Something really cool as tadpoles, they eat all these little tiny things in the water, all kinds of little plankton and algae, but frogs, as we know, especially bullfrogs, they're predators. So they'll actually get a wider mouth and they'll transition from eating little stuff, tiny little microscopic stuff in the water, to eating other fish, other frogs, crickets, all kinds of little stuff. Bullfrogs will eat pretty much anything. Now this little bullfrog here, you can see the end of the tail is actually kind of deteriorating. And they kind of absorb the tail a little bit during this little transitional time. And this little frog can get huge. Bullfrogs get absolutely massive. Some bullfrogs can reach size up to two pounds. That's a huge frog. That's a big old bullfrog. And these little guys, this is gonna be a little tiny baby one when, he, when he's fully developed. So bullfrogs just, especially down south, get absolutely massive. And the tadpoles can be massive as well. They like to eat crawfish, snakes, other frogs. They'll eat anything that they can get a hold of. Now, they actually do have a bit of a different face as a baby. He's gonna get a little bit of a longer snout, his mouth is gonna widen, and his eyes are gonna get much bigger than they are right now, because he's still in that transition stage of going from a tadpole to a frog. And even though he's more frog-like right now, he's gonna look a little bit different than a fully developed baby bullfrog. And he's got all these little specklings, all these little spots, and that color looks more like a tadpole right now. He's got that more baby color right now, I like to call it, and it's for camouflage. Throughout their entire life, as tadpoles and as frogs, they have to be camouflaged. That is one of their number one defenses. And these guys are mostly going to be nocturnal. That's why they have those big eyes right on the top of their head, is because they're mostly going to be nocturnal. Now one thing I used to do when I was little is I'd go out and catch as many tadpoles as I could, whether it was frog or toad tadpoles, and I'd bring them home and I'd set them up in tanks or aquariums and I'd watch them slowly mature, slowly grow until I'd get loads of these little tiny frogs and toads and then I'd go and release them all and it was a really cool thing to see when I was very little and it's really cool to see these bullfrog tadpoles with the tail and they're still developing into a frog. Alright guys, before we end this video, I wanted to say next week we're going to be doing another Q&A video. So if you guys have any questions, just write them down in the comment section. And I'll be trying to answer as many as I possibly can for next week's video. So make sure if you have any questions about me or the channel or any of the animals that we've ever filmed, make sure to write them down in the comment section. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. And if you did enjoy, definitely leave a like. And I will see you guys next time. All right, let's let this little guy go.